Hello everyone. Today in this video, we are going to discuss about the questions that was asked in the recent NAVARD examinations. Okay. I know we are presenting this video a little bit late, but there is reason behind that. Actually, our marathon series was going on and also we waited for the uh, to get maximum questions from the students who have attended the NAVARD examination so that we can present you the maximum number of questions that was asked in the examinations. Okay, here I'll give you the brief explanation of the questions that was asked in the NAWAD examinations. Okay, because earlier also I told you regarding that, that these three exams are interrelated like NAWAD examination, RRB, SO examination and IBPS, AFO examinations. They usually they follow the trends of each other. Okay, if you see the NAWAD examinations paper, they have incre increased the length of their options. Similar was done in the RRB SO exam also. Okay, uh, means they have also increased the length of uh, uh, um, this uh, options. Okay, and few uh, questions were repeated. And uh, so uh, I repeatedly tell you to pre uh, miss, uh, prepare um, the or cover all the previous year papers because there are three to four to five questions which are repeated each year. Okay, so let's see. First question is, uh, was asked from the fisheries, which of the following is fish curing method, salting, blanching, smoking, all or none. Okay, of course, salting, blanching and smoking, or this, all these three are related to the fish curing. Okay, then our answer will be all. Okay, again, one question was asked in, it, in inland fisheries, which fish has been banned due to their predatory nature? Or they are missed by they were damaging our ecosystems. Then options were cutla, rohu, ilsa, African catfish, pink birds. Okay. Then answer to this question is African catfish. Okay. You see, two questions have been covered from the fisheries. Okay. <clears throat> Which state has been declared as a fully organic state and also known as the land of flowers? Options were West Bengal, Karnataka, Sikkim, Gujarat, Pondicherry. Okay. Now you listen. Many see just uh, we, we already we have discussed in the marathon class also that fully organic first fully uh, organic state to be declared was sikkim but few students got confused by this word the, known as the land of flowers no issue the sikkim is also known as the land of flowers the answer will be sikkim see under pkvy farmers are provided financial assistance of rs 50000 per hectare for three years out of which 31,000, that is 60% is provided directly through the DBT for inputs like biofertilizer, biopesticides, organic manure, compost, vermicompost. Okay. See, it is already written. Do you know that Sikkim, Sikkim is the first state in India to declare this fully organic state or this was also covered in the classroom. Next question was, institute evolved in the storage export of organic commodity, APEDA, NAFED, FSSAI, FCI, DMI. Okay. Then answer to this question is, you all know that this was also taught in the class. It was APEDA. Okay. Next, vocational skill training for farmers is provided by you. have seen that from this section, KBK section's question was asked in the IBPS AFO 2020 also. And here also the question is asked regarding that vocational training for the farmers is provided by the KBK. Okay. See, Question language may vary, options may, be, may vary because these all are memory based questions. Okay, but the topics are the same from which the questions were asked. And questions are also same, but maybe the, the options are different and the uh, these uh, questions language are different. Based on the recommendation of the Education Commission and further consideration by the Planning Commission and, and Interministerial Committee, the ICR decided for establishment of Kisi Vigyan Kendra. Okay, Farm Science Center. The first KVK was sanctioned at Pondicherry in 1974 in favor of Tamil Nadu Agriculture University, Combat 2. The KVK was established mainly to impart vocational skill training to the farmers and field extension workers. This was asked in the PSV 2019 also and IPS APO 2020 also. Next, which millets are known as coarse grain millets? Ragi, Jawar, Bajra, Sorghum, Barley, Ragi. Okay. And again, you see sugarcane, wheat, rice, rice, maize, barley, jute, cotton, mesta. Then, of course, grain minerals are Ragi, Jawar, and Bajra. This was also covered in the our live marathon series. Okay. 
you see the millets example of course cereal C, Jowar, Bajra and Ragi, it is clearly given. Which of the following gas is not greenhouse gases? Okay, neon, CO2, methane, CFC and nitrous oxide. Of course, neon is not greenhouse gases. Okay, atmospheric pressure is the most important parameter in weather forecasting. And chlorofluorocarbon, this is responsible for the ozone duplication. Greenhouse gases, CO2, CH4, chlorofluorocarbon, and N2O. N2O is not given here, but N2O is also greenhouse gases. Neon is not neon in this greenhouse gases. This was also taught in the classroom, of, and also, and this, uh, uh, on, I have given this question on YouTube video. Okay, I also taught in the marathon series. I have told you that in, in, in environmental science is also important for topics for the examinations. See, one greenhouse gases was asked from that section. The second question is this. Okay, but the question language was di different. Okay, in, in this question, the, the, the question was regarding that, that where, where does the in agroforestry negative interaction occurs? Then in options, there were like uh, mutualism, proto cooperation. Okay, again, there was a competition, commensalism. Okay, then what happens in mutualism? Two organisms which are associated with each other, they, they both are benefited and their relations are obligatory. Means they, they will be benefited only when they live together. But in case of proto cooperation, both organisms interacting are benefited, but it is not necessary that they should live together. In case of competition, both are harmed. It means it is such condition in which fitness of other, other organism is harmed in presence of one organism. Okay, then the question was asked regarding the negative interactions between, eh? then both organisms were harmed in that answer will be competition. This was not in the options. These are not in the options. Three plus livestock production refers to sylvie posture, aqua pasture, what is sylvie culture, sylvie culture, electrophic, of course it will be sylvie pasture. Forty pasture for fruit trees plus pasture or animals. Forty only to culture fruit trees plus vegetables. Sibley pasture trees plus pasture animals. Okay, forage, forage, forestry, forest trees plus pasture. Shelter waste trees plus crops. Wind breaks trees plus crops. This was also taught in the classroom. Haryana is a use of it on the basis of utility. It is a dual purpose grid. Haryana and this question has been repeated. It was asked in the A4 mains also. Okay. You see the examples, which is the uh, milch purpose. If you talk, then gear, sahiwal, red sindhi, sarpakar, they are the milch, uh, milch purpose. But when you talk about the dual purpose, then Haryana, Ongole, Kankrez, uh, Dioni, Nimari, Dangi, these are the dual purpose. Drought purpose, Halikar, Kilari, Burger, up that uh, Malvi, Siri, Bach, <coughs> Bachur, these all are the drought purpose. Arkhet Kopani related to, clear from the word only, it is related to the Pradhan Mantri Kirsi Chai Yojana. This, was, this topic was also taught in the our marathon series. Which of the following is not the component under Pradhan Mantri Kirsi Chai Yojana? There were five options, all in which the different options were given on regarding the component of the Pradhan Mantri Kirsi Chai Yojana. One option was there regarding uh, this uh, N W D P R A. Okay, means National Watershed Development Project for Rainfed Area. This is not the component of the Pardhamanthi Kirsi Sichai Yojana. Pension scheme for the farmers who are eligible 18 to 40 years in which scheme there are in this, this Pardhan Mantri Mantani Yojana and this uh, in, in, under this scheme also the question was not asked regarding the 18 to 14, 40 years but they have asked that which year age, age groups are eligible under these schemes. Okay, the answer will be 18 to 40 years. See, the government government has introduced an old age pension scheme for all land holdings, a smaller margin of farmers in the country, namely the Pradhan Mantri Kisan Mandan Yojana as a voluntary and contributive pension scheme for the entry age of 18 to 14 years. This scheme is effective from the 9th August 2019. Land holding capacity of medium farmers. Oh, see, this was also taught in the class for the marginal farming. It is less than one hectare. For a small, it is one to two hectare. For semi-medium, it is two to four hectare. Medium, it is four to 10 hectare and large it is 10 or ever. Again, they have asked regarding, they have given the size and, and they have asked 
the given the various option mist drizzle such type okay then the drizzle it is a light liquid precipitation consisting of liquid water drops smaller than those of rain generally smaller than the size was given 0 0.0 0 0.5 mm okay and the size of drizzle was asked Again, one question was asked from the puddling. Okay, the what is, this is what puddling is called wet tillage also. It is such operation which is done in land with the standing water. Okay, puddling operation generally consists of plugging the field in the when there is a standing water till, till when the soil becomes soft and muddy. Okay, it creates now you see it creates an impervious layer below the surface to reduce the deep percolation loss of water and to provide soft seed bed for planting rice. Okay, initially five centimeter to 10 centimeter water is applied depending on the water status of the soil to bring it to saturation and above and the first plugging is carried out. Okay, this was also uploaded in this question in our YouTube video, which mineral is dominant in laterite and laterite soils? Of course, the dominant minerals are kaolinite. The laterite soils equivalent to oxysols in soil taxonomy, but oxysols are not found in India in spite of the favorable condition of water formation. Kyolinite is the dominant clay mineral of these soils and is formed due to the neosynthesis. CTC process is essential step for the production of, of course, it is uh, CTC processing is done in T. Okay. See, the plantation area begin to spread and flourish in Northeast India and South India. T is processed by CTC method. Okay. Cut, tear, and curl. Or orthodox method. Adult male of sheep used for breeding, of course, it's, it's a ram. This, this was also taught in the marathon class. You can see. Okay, now you see a species of you talk about sheep. Adult male is known as ram. One question was asked regarding the mixed farming, that which of the flowing is not true regarding the mixed farming. Exact options we don't know, but one question was asked from the mixed farming. Again, the question was asked, which machine is used for chopping the fodder and crop that is a rotavator, wind rover, chaff cutter, mould cutter, path cutter. Of course, answer is chaff cutter. Under KCC scheme, the loan limit for annual entry and fisheries is 2 lakh, 1.2 lakh, 3 lakh, 2.5 lakh, 1 lakh. This question was also covered in our marathon series. I, I taught there you that now in all the 20s and fisheries are under proud under the KCC and they, they are also get, can get, they will also get the benefit of ISS and maximum they can available the loan up to two lakh rupees. See to cover all the eligible farmers under KCC in a mission mode, KCC saturation drive was launched in 2019. To facilitate easy access to KCC processing fee ins inspection, lease folio charge, and all other services for the fresh and renewable of KCC was waived off. A time limit of 14 days was fixed for issuing KCC after receipt of the applications. Okay, the farmers engaged in the activities related to the annual assessment and fisheries have been included in the KCC scheme and have been extended the benefits of ISS and PRI with sub limit of two lakh rupees. One question was asked regarding the counter farming. Okay, in this uh, where this is um, adopted, where the slope is less than two percent. And soil erosion is a major problem. Okay, so then and this in what happens is a simple conservation practice of farming system that is plugging cultivation and planting across the slope, keeping the same level as far as possible is called counter farming. Again, the question was from the remuneration employment till how many days? Okay, 100, 150, 200, 300, 365. Then you see National Rural Development Guarantee Act, Narega, 100 days of guarantee and skilled wage employment to each rural household. See, this question was asked previously also. The next question was asked regarding the pruning. This is the judicial removal of the plant part to obtain better and quality field that is known as pruning. Age of fixation is the addition of what to the soil? Oxygen, methane, nitrogen, carbon dioxide, hydrogen. Of course, answer will be nitrogen. This was also covered. You can see some this process biological nitrogen fixation. Okay. You have to remember this data, which of these symbiotic nitrogen fixing bacteria, which is tree living bacteria, associative symbiotic bacteria, because the examples of such questions are asked in the example. Cotton ground, most in which agroclimatic region, western plateau in hilly region, eastern plateau, coastal plains, transgenetic plains, southern hilly regions. Of course, it is grown mostly in western plateau and hills region. Now you see cotton fiber is simply uh, and elongation or growth of an epidermal cell of the seed coat. Cotton is mostly grown under the western plateau in Lee region. This was also covered. 
next question was asked regarding, regarding the fss ai full form then you all know the full form of this food safety and standards authority of india this was also covered in our marathon series who proposed msp this is again repeated question this was question was already asked in the ibps apo means this year also the answer is ca cp repeated uh, many video i made you on the msp you all have made you all have must done this question correct in the examination all see while it, recommending price policy of various committees and its its mandate the commission keeps in mind the various terms referenced given to cacp in 2009 according okay see miss msp is recommended by ca cp science of growing vegetables is known as floriculture aquaculture floriculture sericulture moriculture of course it is oliculture see the term oliculture is originated from the latin words already meaning spot her an english word meaning raising of plants as per economic survey agriculture sectors contributed in, in india gva is I, with the exact question you don't know whether it was asked of 2019 20 or 2021 okay but if you take up the date 20 it is 17.8 percent you see about 54.6 percent of the total workforce in the country is still engaged in the agriculture and livestock sector activities which which accounts for approximately 17.8 17.8 percent of the country's gva gross value added for the year 1920 at current price agri census is being conducted once in two year one year five year 10 year eight year of course it is conducted once in five year see the agriculture census in india are being conducted Finally, since 1970-71, as a part of the World Census Agriculture of the Food and Agriculture Organization of the UN, this census is conducted once in five years. This was also covered in our marathon series production of wild seed according to the fourth advance estimate. And then, if you see the wild seed according to the fourth advance estimate, you can see what is the production of wild seed. You see, 33.2 million ton. land holding of medium farmers okay this question is already discussed so any the scheme was asked eh? this this is a scheme was for the street vendors okay it, it was asked for whom this scheme was launched then it was for the street vendors dormancy breaking by using temperature is known as this stratification it is preheating and uh, treating seed at low temperature 2 to 8 degrees celsius for 24 hours okay there were few more questions which were asked in the examinations which we have, we have not included here let me tell you that questions uh, one question was asked regarding that which of the flowing is the renewable source of energy bio uh, options were biogas and uh, coal nuclear energy okay uh, so, uh, this uh, biomass not biogas biomass coal nuclear energy natural gas of course then biomass is the renewable source of energy okay one question was that which of the flowing is legume powder options were cow pea glycerin and it was a jowar then one more option options were there the answer will be cowpea and glycerin okay again the one question was asked there regarding the boiler that uh, used for the meat purpose um, this uh, sold in the market for the milk uh, the meat purpose the answer was boiler again one question was asked regarding that uh, um, uh, trees which shed their leaves during the autumn or winter options were perennial evergreen deciduous the answer would be deciduous Again, one question was asked from the command area also. Okay, that uh, under this irrigable area by canal irrigation project. That question was asked. Means that how many questions we have got from the students? I think from the second sheet we have covered the all the questions. Okay, now just what you have to do? Just you have to follow the see these questions, follow the patterns, emphasis on such topics. Okay, again I'll give you one more video of the RRB SO examinations. Okay, you can analyze this. both video and accordingly you can prepare for the ibps apo examinations okay thank you